guys it's your girl leah here back again with another video for you guys as you guys can see by the title you already know what i'm about to be doing honey yes and i'm going to be showing you guys how i made my intro because a lot of you guys have been asking me how did i made my intro so i will be showing you guys how i made it okay so we're just gonna hop right into the video okay so the first thing i did was it's pretty simple this intro is super simple it's easy to do i just decided to make it real quick to put in front of my videos since i haven't put any intro in front of my videos lately that's why i made it and to put it in front of my in my video so the first thing i did was i went on to fonto and then i clicked on the camera icon and then i clicked on plain images i clicked on the plain white box and i changed the size to 1 280 and 720 done then what i did was i just saved the background which is this white background save image and then the next thing i did was i went on to CapCut, clicked on the plus sign photos and i added and i added the white background so i'm going to delete this and then i'm going to open it up for 10 seconds because i want it to be like 10 seconds not too long just short and simple okay 10 seconds let's go i think mine was a little bit shorter i think it was like six seconds but i'm gonna leave it at 10 seconds so the second thing the second thing i did was i clicked on text which i used the fonts that were already in CapCut. that's what i did so i clicked on add text and i just added l space t space p which stands for leah the plug and then i clicked on style I changed the font to New York and I also went back to style and I changed the color to black. Then I opened it up just how it is in the middle. Okay, we're going to put it back to the middle. Great. And then I just, what I did was, I think I added like shadow behind it as well. No, I didn't, but I'm still going to add it to make it look a little bit more better. The distance, I'm going to put it a little bit more closer like this and the angle so i'm gonna leave it like this i'm gonna open it up for the entire video all the way to the end and then now what i'm gonna do is i'm going to click on text again and then i'm gonna write my name which is leah the plug and i'm going to click on font and the font that i use was it's very complicated to pronounce is sig signaton yeah that's what i think i used yeah that's it and then i just placed it underneath just beneath it like this and yeah and that's what i did i'm gonna add the animations afterwards i'm just adding everything to make sure that i put them in the right place and yeah these are the two things that i added from this app i'm gonna show you guys how i added the subscribe button but it's not from this app it's from another app which is called filmora go so for the letters the animation that i use we're gonna go into animation and then we're going to use concentrate we're going to put it at three seconds maybe then for my name at the bottom what i'm gonna do is click on click on animation and the animation that i use is called random letters so i'm going to put it at three seconds as well in order for them to come in at the same time so it should look like this great so for Leo the plug i think i'm gonna put it a little bit more smaller great just like the m1 that's done i'm going to save it then i'm going to go into the app called filmora go i'm going to click on new project import the video that you just saved from CapCut, and then i'm going to click on stickers because in stickers is where you have all of the little stickers of subscribe button or little heart icons but this app is a paid app some of the things might be free but some of them are not the subscribe button that i use was i'm going to go into this second category i'm going to look for the subscribe button okay it's this one right here i'm going to bring it down at the bottom and i'm going to make it a little bit more smaller I think it's this one let me see yes i think it's this one it looks familiar it looks similar i'm going to check for another one just to make sure replace it and let's see if we find another one yep that's the one that i used and i also added like a little heart icon above okay i'm going to leave this just the way it is i'm think i'm i think i'm gonna put it to like six seconds like onto here i'm gonna leave the letters coming first and then i'm gonna add the subscribe button great so after that i'm going to add this little heart icon sticker and 
which is this one right here great and i'm gonna place it like in the corner i'm going to make it small and i'm going to tilt it a bit and then i'm gonna place it like right here so this is what it's looking like right now great so i'm going to make the video stop on to here so this is how i made my intro pretty simple super easy and i'm going to also show you guys how i added the song to it so the song i found it from soundcloud you guys just have to go on my page on soundcloud i saved it in a private album um i think i'm gonna put it public i think i could put it public or it's already public i'm going to see so we're gonna go on to soundcloud and we're gonna go on my albums playlist and albums it says that it's private but how do i put it public i already don't know so i made it public and you guys could go on to my playlist and check out which songs you would like to put as your youtube background because all of these songs that i picked out is free is you're not gonna get copyrighted from them so the one that i use is called 16 miss calls so you guys just have to scroll down until you find it which is this one right here <laughs> great so you guys just have to click on it click on the three little dots in the corner then you click on copy link once the link is copy you go on you go on safari then you click on the search bar and you search for sound cloud converter once you found that you're going to click on the first link which should have like a little cloud icon in the corner so once you found that little cloud icon with the blue square box around it you're going to click on that link and here is the easy link you could just add the link that you copied convert it and it's going to convert the song then you click on download the song and it's going to download directly to your files once it's downloaded you're just going to come out of here you're going to go on to okay what you're going to do okay you guys are going to save this i'm going to put it to the maximum then i'm going to export it then now what i'm going to do is i'm going to go on to vlo or you guys could even add the song on CapCut. okay so we're going to go on to CapCut since it's free because i think vlo to add a song is pay you have to pay so i'm just gonna add the video right here once the video is right here what i'm going to do is i'm going to leave it right here i'm going to come out of here and i'm going to go back in files and you're going to look for a 16 missed calls the song that you just downloaded i'm going to click on it and i'm going to share it to CapCut. so you're going to click on import audio to CapCut. then it's imported directly onto the video that you would like to add the song to <laughs> i'm going to start from the part where i wanted to start from so i'm going to split this delete the first part and i'm going to drag it all the way to the front delete this and i'm going to split the back delete the rest i'm just going to make this fade out fade out duration i'm going to put it to like one second so you guys could add this part but there's another part that has like the beat which is at the back but i just added this part to show you guys something different because the song does have like two parts that sounds different which is this part and the original one that you guys saw on my page so yeah this is basically it this is how the intro looks hopefully this video helped you guys make sure to like comment share and subscribe turn on notification bell so you guys can know whenever your girl posts a new video thank you guys for watching and excuse me for the little tick 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 clock sound in the background that's just the clock that's on the wall and it's very quiet so that's why you're hearing that have a nice day and i'm gonna see you guys in the next video bye